The 10 GHz Quick Starter is shown here. It makes use of a surplus dish with a transverter and feed horn replacing the original LNB. The transverter is mounted inside the black plastic box enabling a very short coaxial cable to connect to the feed horn minimizing RF losses. Here is the transverter module by Kuhn Electronic TB6NT and it is available in kit form for home construction. The box to the left contains the construction notes. The small box to the right contains the surface mount resistors and capacitors. The larger box contains the semiconductors and the larger components. The tin plate box is in four pieces, two sides, a top and a bottom. Contained inside the box are the labels for the finished transverter black RF absorbing foam necessary for the inside of the lid and of course the printed circuit board. Here is the printed circuit board in a bit more detail and now we look at the completed printed circuit board. Here at the top in more detail is the IF and TR switching circuitry. The top SMA is the IF connector. The centre SMA is the receive input and horizontally to the left from it the 10 GHz RF amplifier. Horizontally leading to the bottom SMA is the transmit RF amplifier. At the other end of the PCB are the local oscillator and local oscillator multiplication circuits. Viewing the top side the larger components are two 10 GHz resonators in the centre and the local oscillator tune circuits to the right. This is the end view of the RF and DC connections. You will see that there is little unused space between the top and bottom covers. The marking out for holes must therefore be millimetre accurate. 